Now, welcome back for round six, everybody. I'm sorry, round five of six. Round six will be starting in about an hour. All right, guys, we've got done with everything from Friday through Sunday. They should all be processed to YouTube at this point. Uh, we're about to start everything here that ended Monday in this video. And then we will begin to start everything that ends tonight at 12 p.m. Right now we're in the ends of the 15 Supreme Baseball 10-box case break. Again, Supreme's a high-end set by Thompson. It's always been great, whether it be football or baseball. There's some great hidden gems in there. <clears throat> There's some beautiful hits in Supreme. The Supreme styling clear cuts are very nice. The jumbo autographed um, relics they have in there you come across every once in a while are very nice as well. They got some great booklet hits. All in all, Supreme is a prime set. Got a Leaf jersey, some diamond, 15 Supreme football, a three box break, and we'll end with a full size helmet. All right. We've been through a lot tonight, man. I've seen, I swear we've seen a lot of Cowboys and Raiders tonight. Yeah, every 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 night is different, but a lot of Cowboys and Raiders tonight. Start with some 07 Premier number 74. Looks like we housed the Jaguars in this one. Die Corona, West Virginia, Snyder, Dustin Harmon, G. Doob, Dem Pitch, Mudisifa, and Big Dave. Not often we get to do older sets anymore because unfortunately people don't bid on them enough. I wish they did. Older sets are great. And people just, I don't know, people don't get it sometimes. I mean, I, well, we would do so many older sets if people would buy into them. I mean, you want to do older years, I'd do 04 if we could do it. But, I mean, so many more times than not, we actually lose money on these sets. Which I don't understand. You're getting cars that have been untouched for, in this point, 9 years. Or 10 years, technically. Depending on the release date. Alright, it's one pack per box. You get 5 hits, plus a manufacturer hit. Sometimes a manufacturer hit will also have an auto with it. Alright, get one base card, and what a sad story this one was, unfortunately. The old McNair to 225. <clears throat> we will start with a Mark Bolger. <clears throat> There's an auto we didn't expect to see. Dem pitch with the Rams to 25 Mark Bolger auto. LG Greenwood for the Steelers. Dem pitch. Um, next, we'll have a Robert Meacham. Nice rookie quad patch auto for the Saints. G Dube. This guy. He was a Bronco at one point in his career. At this point, he still was a Bronco. To 75 Premier Remnants, Jay Cutler. Boom on a beast mode. Rookie Premier patches to 75 for the Bills. Krabby Joe. Nice hit, Krabby. That's what you were looking for. And we'll end with an autograph version. 16 of 25 Premier Stitchings. Jason Hill for the Niners. Who disify 24. Rare do you come across autograph versions of these. Sweet hit. Yeah, nice pull the beast mode out of there. That's great. People still think beast mode is going to come back. I think he's done at this point. Because, I mean, AP's coming to a close here shortly, too, I think. I hate to say it right, but... Yeah. The days of AP are over. I mean, he could probably still have some production, but I don't, I don't know, man. Too many injuries recently. Sick, we got four autos out of that. <clears throat> yeah, we got four autos. That was cool. Been looking for an LG. I don't even know who he is. 15 playbook, a two box break. Number 73 is next. We got West Virginia, Red Sox, Keb, Trib. Swoosh, Dem Pitch, Nuno, Dustin Harmon, West Virginia, 04 Trib, Krabby Joe, Rattle 11, Doc, Lost Boogs, and Dem Pitch.
Maybe there's a 15th playbook earlier. Let's see if we can pull out of it this time. Last time we got a dual booklet of Gurley and Melvin Gordon. Let's see if we can repeat that. Melvin Gordon's been on fire. Gurley's just plays for the Rams, unfortunately, with no offense. Good defense, no offense. But you can't account for as bad as he's been with that offense. He, he has to do something. That has just been horrible, what he's done. What he did last year to what he's doing now. All right, we'll start with a dual Montana Dwight Clark, the catch. We've actually pulled an autograph jersey of this before. How about a Von Miller autograph relic to 99 for the Broncos? Meyer, nice hit. Got to 49, a Devontae Parker for the Dolphins, West Virginia, be a rookie jumbo dual patch. May have sit on Devontae Parker. He had a good game last week, fantasy-wise. I don't think the Dolphins had a good game at all. All right. Oh, he was. For some reason, I thought that was a rookie autograph. My mistake. Wow. The Greenwood. All right. Got door set Emmett Smith to 199. That was a sweet hit then. Ho! Oh, saw him once, saw him twice. Steve Larson to 25. Krabby Joe. Storied signatures. Nice hit. And a Carlos Williams for the Bills, 04 Trib to 199. So a Von Miller, both our autographs were either a great veteran, Super Bowl MVP, or one of the best wideouts to play the game. Very nice. Nice break of playbook. Avante Parker was low, only had one high numbered hit, and that was Carlos Williams. Got a Gold Rush football jersey up next with some 13 limited. It's a two-box break, number 44. Ah, Dem pitch with Arizona. We got Meyer, Keb, Tharp with the Bills, Craig Amatic with his Bengals, Christopher Lambert, Samway, Dallas. 600. Janaconda, Doc with the Steelers, Nuno with the Niners, 600, and Keb. Alright, 13 limited is due for us. So I know we pulled a Jordan Reed out the last one. I'll take that back. We saw, I'm still stuck on the EJ Manual we saw earlier. Never want to pull an EJ Manual, even though he's on the front of the box. Between him and Geno Smith, the only like, real quarterbacks that came out in 13. There's some great players that came out in 13, just not quarterback-wise. I mean, DeAndre, Le'Veon, Cheeseburger, Giovanni Bernard, Keenan Allen. There's a lot that came out in 13, just no QBs. Unless you consider Geno Smith a good quarterback, which I hope you don't. Got a Miles Austin of 49 to start it off. Steven Jackson, another spotlight of 25. Wes Welker, 399. Dustin Hopkins, 299, rookie. Got a Justin Brown monikers, rookie autograph for Pittsburgh. Doc to 299. Blue Chips, Tyler Eifert. Finally, hopefully, we'll get to see him play sooner or later. To 99 for the Bengals, rookie. And then a Terrence Williams, the 49, Phenoms, rookie autograph, 1, 2, 3, 4, break, patch, Keb, 0528. Alright, we've done good on these tonight. Pulled a Jordan Reed out of here earlier, actually. Jordan Reed's been seen a lot this evening.
All right, Gold Rush jerseys. I know I repeat myself, but these are for people that are, have not bought into them before. They are through Steel City Collectibles if you ever need any information on them. Find their full checklist there. It's a truly loaded checklist, though. Everything from Montana's, Marino's, Elway's, Sanders, Walter Payton's, I mean, Peyton Manning's, Jared Goss, Ezekiel Elliott's. There is a lot. <laughs> Seventy-four Nolan Ryan, Robbie. All right, who shall we have this time? I'm not sure. Girly. Is that a girly mod? I think it's a girly mod. Is a Todd Gurley awesome hit for the Rams? Samway fifty-five. Uh, I still think he'll bring it back. Awesome auto. Great hit on a Gurley. It's Leaf certified. Todd Gurley. Man, he was a beast last year. And he started off slow. Don't give up on him yet. He started off slow this year, but it can happen. He'll pick it back up, I'm sure. Probably made a lot of people go 0-2, but hey. Great hit on a Gurley auto. Nice boom off the bat. All right, we'll switch to baseball next. <coughs> Excuse me, guys. And we'll do some 16 Archive Signature Edition Baseball. This set's been very cool. For any of you guys that collected anywhere back in the day, basically it takes, it's an encased autograph card per box. It's magnetically sealed, top, it's magnetically cased, top sealed. It's also a top stamped buyback card that is on card autographed by whatever player it may be. Pull some great ones so far, some very sequentially low numbers. I mean, so a couple of fours, a couple of threes, a one or two. It's been very interesting. There's some big hits. I mean, Koufax, Nolans, uh, Mickey Mantle Autos. There's so many different hits that can come out of this set. It's very, very unique. I love stuff like this. It reminds me of when we used to break Lee Fink and other sets that they're just different than others. I mean, that's why we do things like Upper Deck Portraits if we can ever get our hands on it. All right. Oh, Mike Piazza up front. Great catcher. Mets and Dodgers really known for. Played for a few other teams. I think he ended his career with the Marlins. Alright. What will we have here? It'll be numbered one of two. It's an old Topps Gold. One of two. Omar Vizquel. That's sweet. I haven't seen Omar Vizquel in a long time. Great old shortstop for the Mariners. Line Matt GBP, one of two. Tops gold, 93 tops gold. Nice. One of two, low number hits. They're all about Omar Vizquel, and I remember, I think we've seen him in 15 Supreme, actually. He pulled his autograph in there. Or in one of the sets, one of the baseball sets we've done, we pulled his auto before. All right, box number two. I'll be to 56. Carlos Berga? Not a Carlos Berga. Berga. Yeah, old Cleveland Indian. 27 of 56. It's a little higher number one. This is from 96. For the Cleveland Indians. Damn pitch with Cleveland. They pulled some good ones too so far. I remember now I'm very familiar with Carlos. Robbie knew who he was. I just remember from collecting like a 92, 93. All 
All right, guys, we got a Leaf Mini up next. Then we'll do some 11 Prime Sigs. What a set that usually turns out to be. Doc, you've had good luck with it recently. A 16 Leaf Mini Helmet with some 16 Prime Sigs. It's a two-box break number 39. Diego up top, Dallas Mavs Cowboys. Nuno with the Bills, Jen Lang, Dallas, Meyer, Wyatt, Chief, Justin Harmon, Doc, Krabby Joe, Dallas with Minnesota, Keb with my Eagles, Dallas, Wyatt, Doc, and Keb. I don't know, I have not seen Schultz tonight. <clears throat> I have not seen him yet. I know you want to rub it in, chat, but yeah, he hasn't showed up. Maybe he's hiding in defeat. Yeah, that was pretty. Uh, you're right, actually, Doc. It was too. That was a two shortstop break. <clears throat> two old ninety shortstops. <clears throat> oh, excuse me, guys. All right. Jose Fernandez, 21 consecutive batters retired. Wow. That's pretty sick. Great Marlins pitcher. He's still young, too. He, he, I think he didn't come out until like 14, 13, 14. All right, we'll start with a Brett Favre. Marcus Colston. Fran Tarkenton. Golden Tate to 149 for the Lions. Wyatt. <clears throat> Got Devontae Parker, New Wave. Non numbered version. And our hit will be oh, a gun to the breaker. Harold Carmichael. 5 of 10. Blue Ink Auto. Great old school Y out for Philly. Kev 0528. Beautiful hit. Uh, if you want to part with it, let me know. I'll happily make you a trade for it. 5 of 10, Harold Carmichael. Oh, Schultz lost to you? You beat Schultz in fantasy? Yeah. Oh, that's why Schultz isn't showing up. I understand. I understand. All right, on to a Leaf Mini. And we get just some 11 Prime Sigs. Well, 16 Prime Sigs just pulled us a nice Legend Auto. And I had to take the gun for that one. Goes to Keb. It's hard to watch a Harold Carmichael to 10 pass you by. But it does happen. Chip of Joy is sad, sad, sad. <laughs> All right. Boom! Demarcus Ware, unfortunately, has a fractured forearm. Meyer! Awesome hit on a Demarcus Ware. Meyer, 1, 2, 1, 3, 7, 1. Great hit. Big hit. This boy was a staple uh, outside linebacker of the Cowboys forever. And then they moved to change their scheme. They tried playing as a defensive end. It didn't work out very well. Awesome hit on Demarcus Ware. Great hit. Glad he's on the Broncos and not on the Cowboys anymore. Alright, now let's do a five box break of 11 Prime Sigs. This will be number 85. Got Button Girl up top. It's a five box break. Half an inner case. Chief Stone one. Asmodeus. Good to see you, sir. You play Robbie and uh, Robbie ten and me eleven. Oh, good. Well, just uh, mark those off as L's. Oh, I can't speak for Robbie. Mark mine off as an L for you. You're going down, Chad. It's happening, man. Doc Craigamatic line man. Though even if one of your quarterbacks goes down, you got a good backup. Have you even started Drew Brees or has been constantly Cam? Where Burt, Doc, Giants, and Jay Whitby on the bottom. Alright guys, five boxes of Prime Sigs. Similar build to what you saw in 16. If you're not familiar with older years of Prime Sigs, try to get familiar with it. It's a great, 
Great set. It's all right. I got backups, chat. It'll be okay. And by that point, I'll be probably playing the waiver wires right. <clears throat> it's one autograph per box, a couple of base cards, usually a prime proof parallel as well. Lovely checklist. We have pulled some monsters out of here in the past. Definitely try again tonight. Got a Vernon Davis to get it going. Jonathan Stewart hurt. Dwayne Blow, uh, Bow, Blue Prime Proof. Doc with the Chiefs. And then Jeremy Curley, rookie auto to 49 for the Jets. Button Girl. Yeah, this set you has done you very well, it seems. Yeah, this set has just some crazy players you pull out that you don't see in other sets. It's great for legend autos. It's great for veteran autos. The values on Beckett are insane on this set. They're very high value cards. Start with a Ozzie Newsom, Lamb Barney, Jimmy Graham to 99 red prime proof. And a Dion Lewis rookie auto to 199 for Philly. I don't think he's a Eagle anymore. It might be a Jet now. Yeah, but I beat Red Dog, and you think you're gonna beat me, Chat? Oh no, nah, man, it's not happening. I may not have Matt Forte, but I'll still have running backs. I got plenty to choose from. All I gotta do is play the right matchup. All right. Let's see what we can get out of box number three. Start with a Mark Duper, old school. Super Duper. Super Duper. Marino's old goal two guy, right? Yes. Jim. Laurinaitis to ninety nine. And a Joe Lefigid to 199 rookie auto for the Colts, Dustin Harmon. If Breeze didn't play, but I'm going to be glad you started Cam instead, though. I think Cam did better than Breeze. Cam was a top scorer in fantasy. <clears throat> a Harold Baines? Oh, sweet. Harold Reigns or Baines? Baines. Oh, yeah, okay. <clears throat> we've seen two Carlton Fisks, a couple John Small. Who else have we seen? There's been some good names. There's no time for that, though. We're getting there. All right. Got a Ben Tate. Romo. Lydell Mitchell. To 25 green and a redemption. Rookie Silver Signature RPS number 245. Oh, okay. Uh, dun, dun, 245 will be. Jordan Todman. Looks like we're in the Jays. That's the way they did this. It'll be Julio Jones. Expired in 13, but no worries. Usually Panini is very good with expired redemptions. It's not guaranteed, but you usually are good with Panini. Chief 286. Awesome hit. Oh yeah, I got I gotta go and think I'm gonna win, Chet. You have to. We'll see. Week eleven. Injuries can occur. A little side. I knew that was coming. <laughs> we'll see. We'll see. Let's let's wait till week eleven comes, and then, then we'll then we'll handle all that. Because for all I know, my half my team could be gone right and injured. Yeah, Wentz, man, last night, it's not what he did passing the ball or running the ball or whatever Wentz did last night. He looked good all across the board on that one. What impressed me with him 
was his ability to read the defense. He did a very good job of that. Eddie George. Beanie. Timmy to 99. And we'll end with a Tolbert to 49 for the Chargers. West Virginia. Nice autograph on a Tolbert. Coastal Carolina boy. The Browns fired six scouts who liked Wentz over Goff. Really? Wow. No, I heard nothing of that. It's pretty interesting, though. Hey, man, Wentz looks like he knows what he's doing. I understand the, the, the hesitation with going for him over Goff. I get it. Guy played for a little school. Never really a lot of experience. Only, 20, I think, 20-something 20 starts. It wasn't much. So he didn't have enough to go off of him. But, I mean, he had the potential. I mean, it's only two games in, so I mean, he could he could turn out to be Ryan Leaf. You never know. <clears throat> Chat week eleven. I, I'll be, I'll bet you I'll, I'll make a I'll make a side bet with you week eleven. No question about it. All right, guys. A Leaf jersey with some sixteen prime sigs, number nineteen. This again ended Monday. Everything that's ending tonight will start in about half an hour. Have two more breaks after this with a TriStar mini helmet and some origins. <clears throat> we got Noodle Nugget, Dem Pitch, Scamp, Eric Eagles, Unforgive. No, I'm not. No, not at all scared, Chad. I'm just waiting to week eleven. I'm a smart better. I'm going to wait to see if I have players that are available to play. Gotta wait. Doc, Eric Eagles. A red dog with the Dolphins. Wrigley, Fias, Pravitska, and Fias on the bottom. Well. Got the break of the gun on the last break with a nice Harold Carmichael autograph to 10. Old school eagle. All right. One pack per box. Similar build to any other year, though. We just did it a minute ago as well. You get the one autograph and a couple of hits. Uh, one autograph and a couple of base cards. Parallels and inserts. Got a Austin Davis, John Elway, <clears throat> Namath. Good name so far. What do I have for the Carmichael? Uh, it depends what you want. I mean, who are you looking for? What team? Uh, 149, Austin Sinfair and Jenkins. If you're looking for Eagles, I definitely have Eagles. If you're looking for other teams, let me know. Prime Timers, Russell Wilson, <clears throat> non numbered. And a Jonathan Williams. Seen him a lot lately. Uh, on Swatch rookie autograph to 199. Okay. He will be a Bill Scamp. Scamp, what's up, man? I haven't seen you for a minute. Hope everything's going good. Uh, used to buy the Redskins a lot, 0 and 2. How does it feel to be the talked up part of uh, the NFC East and then start out 0 and 2 while you have two teams 2 and 0 and 1 1 and 1? I mean, it could change in a heartbeat, but still. All right, guys, on to a Leaf autograph jersey. Ravens, Giants. Okay, let me look. Uh, you have to give me a little while. Give me till uh, later on tonight. It's going to be late tonight before I can actually dig in and look. But I'm sure I have something. What do we have? And he's been popping up a decent amount, too. Second time we've seen him dock with a Holmgren. A Mike Holmgren. Uh, this one's a little different, though. This one's actually inscribed more. Super Bowl 31 champs inscribed. Coach. A very nice autograph and inscribed. Great hit. And we saw him last week, actually. But he, we saw him at a gold rush. 
So I'm saying if certain guys have signing sessions and things like that, and they'll pop out more often than others. Oh, great hit. The coach. The coach. I've seen a lot of coaches in Ditka, too. I've seen him a few times. I've pulled Vermeil once or twice. Marv Levy's, of course. Uh, Did I see Ditka on Sunday, man? He was looking rough. He got that beard going on. Made him look oh, older. He's looking rough. Got a 16 TriStar Mini with some 14 playbook number 61. It'll sell around you. What do you have a lot of, I guess you have a lot of Packers fans in your area. There are a lot of Packers fans everywhere. A lot of Steelers fans too. Um, actually, where we live, Doc, um, it's it's a pretty big Steelers town. There's a lot of Steelers fans in Myrtle Beach. A lot, there's a lot of Steelers bars around here too. A lot of Cowboys fans everywhere. It's just like any city you go, though. The, the, with three three things you'll always find in any city you go, or a few things you'll always find, is you always find Cowboys fans. You always find Yankees fans. You always find Lakers fans. You'll find Patriots fans, Celtics fans, Steelers fans. I mean, it's, it's wherever you go, they're going to be. Though the Patriots fan base has jumped up, you know, a hundred thousand since 1999 or 2001, or the first year they won was. All right, Let's start with some 14 playbook. It's one pack per box. You get two hits, a booklet hit, and another hit to go along with it. <clears throat> Bill O'Brien. We bet we pulled Bill Parcells one time. It looks like we got two books. What do you say, chat? Two books never good. Let's see if you're right. Two ninety nine. Cody Lattimore to start it off. For the Broncos, so far, chance right. Winter Soldier 32. Be a rookie autograph booklet to 299. And a Mike Evans. First of the print run to 199 for the Bucks. Ant's dad. Rookie dual patch jumbo booklet. <clears throat> I'm 2 0 in Nuno's league with you, chat. I took Nuno out week one, didn't I, Nuno? Oh and one. Did you? I think you won last week though, didn't you? This week that just passed. All right, guys, on to a TriStar Mini. As always, they do have upsized tickets available. And we'll end with Origins after the Mini here. Last break from Monday. And we'll take a short, short Breakers break and be back at twelve ish. -ish. <laughs> Ish. <laughs> we still got stuff ending on eBay for like the next hour or so. It looks like, man, Packers and Packers got the Golden Boy horning. <clears throat> the box score. The Paul Horning, 56 Heisman Trophy winner, 61 NFL MVP, Packers Hall of Fame, Pro Football Hall of Fame, 86. This boy was something else. It is PSA DNA certified popping out of there on us. See no sightings of an upsize ticket. Nice hit on a horning, the box score. Always with the Packers, the box score. Ah, not a good Monday morning for your Packers. Especially if you didn't see the game and you woke up to see that you got beat by the the Adri the the first uh, Sam Bradford for starters, and a and a, 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 a AP Vic a AP list Vikings, horrible. Sixteen Origins number twenty. All right, a number twenty. Wow, we've been ending this a lot lately, though. New sets. Origins is a beautiful set. The autographs are great on here. The design on the cards are great. There's some beautiful booklet hits. There's a lot of different stuff. A great multi signs. It's a beautiful set. Pull it some nice little numbers already. Yeah, it's been an awesome set so far.
We have to do a case break of Supreme here in a little while. <clears throat> Still have Diamond and a bunch of other stuff ending as well. All right. Sixteen. Oh. 16 Origins. One pack per box. You get three hits, usually two autos and a relic. I know I repeat myself. It's always for people to just jump in for the first time, too. You always want to try to explain what's in sets, if you can. Got a Big Ben to start off. I didn't get anything to Antonio Brown this week. Edelman. Fitzy. Parallel will be a Brandon Marshall to 150. Got a Dak. Dak sighting Williams Nick. To 99. Rookie two color three break patch. Awesome hit. Behind that, got a Wendell Smallwood for Philly. So I'll carry the ball once. Nice hit. Gold signing to 25. 14 to 25 gold signing Wendell Smallwood. And we'll end with a Keenan Reynolds for the Ravens. 04 Trib. Nice rookie autograph, three color patch. Well, at least the Ravens beat the Brownies. Dennis Pitta. What happened to Dennis Pitta? All right, Cody, have a good night. All right, guys, that's going to be it for everything from Monday. We're going to take a short break, be back around 12-ish. We may be a couple minutes behind. We're a little bit lagging. Got to go to catch up a couple things. But yeah, well, we'll be back around 12 for everything that's ending tonight. Uh, what are we in right now? I know we're in the... Oh, we're in Diamond. Ooh, Diamond. Another great set for us. Diamond is awesome. Lots it, of over hundred dollar cards pulled in that out of these boxes. Yeah, and then the Supreme three box break. Ending after that, and we'll end with a full size helmet. It'll end after the video started, but we will still um it'll be broke the last break of the video. Alright guys, we're gonna take a break. We'll see you in about twenty minutes, guys. <laughs> 